Back tonight, KYW Encore, 18 minutes now before 5 o'clock. KYW will depart in about 18 minutes, and WKYC will enter. Uh, General Sardoff is stuck outside in front. Uh, General Sardoff is stuck out in front. There's no... Uh, let me see if I can get Don McCann to go down and open the door. You won't do it. Well, Don, would you please, could you just, it'll just take a minute. Where, where's it? Hey, everybody at the parties, could you, could you hold down the party for a minute? Could you hold down the noise? Just one second, let me explain something to you. Jack, Jack Parr, would you, would, could you sit down for a second? Thank you, Jack. Uh, uh, listen, uh, Chet, Chet, could you please sit down? And, okay, leave, leave, leave David alone and over, David over on the other side, please sit down. Um, uh, General Sarnoff is down in front, and he is stuck uh, down in front. There's no key to get in. Uh, where, where are they all running? They're all running out. They're they're running out the door. Trying, and boy, I never saw so many people run out the door so fast. They must be going down to try to help the general. He must be. He must wheel a lot. They really ran out the door. Even David Suskind left in a hurry. I don't understand. All right, we'll. Uh, I hope they get back. I hope they manage to get the door open. 16 to 5. 14 minutes now before 5 o'clock. This crowd senses something. They know that something big is happening here. Hey, I'll be dog Merv Griffin. Hi, Merv. Yeah, Merv, did you notice what happened to Regis on the bonfire there, Merv? Did you happen to see that? Yeah, I guess that choked you up a little bit there. Uh, Merv, how does it feel to be watching your new employers and your old employers getting kind of together this way? Does it kind of choke you up a little bit? Yes, I can tell you're quite emotional about that, Merv. I noticed that you started to go try to help the general, too, didn't you, Merv? A huh? little bit of butter on every bread you can find. Hey, speaking of the general, let's we got to get back outside to Herman Schlemiel, everybody, and find out if they've been able to get General Sarnoff into the building yet. Uh, we'll need the uh, the grenadiers out there still, or the bagpipers still playing. Uh, let's go to Herman Schlemiel. Uh, yes, thank you very much, Jay. This is Herman Schlemiel down in front of the building. We have uh, large crowds of people gathered out here. General Sarnoff is having a chicken salad sandwich in his limousine, uh, waiting until approximately 5 o'clock, and he will be allowed back in the building. Jack Parr is out here. And uh, he is, uh, actually, he has the popcorn concession out in front. Quite a crowd is gathered. They're all asking who everyone is, all this array of stars out here. And we're hoping very shortly that the bagpipers will play again. Oh, there go the bagpipers. The bagpipers are playing again, Jay. Uh, General Sarov looks very happy with the bagpipers. Uh, or the chicken salad sandwich, I'm not sure which right now. Uh, can I have a bite of your chicken salad sandwich, General? No, I can't have a bite. Um, well, I didn't really, I don't like chicken salad anyway, but if you got a good hot dog in there, I wouldn't mind that. No. Well, we're waiting, Jay. Uh, he'll be coming into the building very shortly. I think they're getting a locksmith. Uh, last we had heard, Don McGannon had swallowed the key to the building, and, and nobody was getting in or out or something like that. Back up to you, Jay Lawrence. Thank you very much. We'll get back to Herman Schlemiel, who's down in front of the building in just a few short moments. Uh, this is Jay Lawrence back up here as KYW slowly makes its way toward Philadelphia and the new bouncing baby WKYC uh, re-enters Cleveland with uh, the Jaybird program. It's now 12 minutes before 5 o'clock in the morning. That's Ian Whitcomb, everybody. It's nine minutes until five o'clock in the morning. Uh, let's go back outside and check if uh, General Sarnoff has been able to get into the building yet. Herman Schlemiel, would you come in, please, Herman? Uh, thank you very much, Dave. This is Herman Schlemiel out in front of the uh, KYW building, soon to be the WKYC building. Uh, perhaps some of you remember it as the old WTAM building, or any number of other buildings. Perhaps it was the old Ohio Gas building, but you remember the building. Uh, and I'm down here, right in front, uh, General Sarnoff is sitting in his car right now. He's finished his chicken salad sandwich, and he started on a tuna salad uh, and pastrami sandwich. He has to wait until 5 o'clock until he can come to the building, Jay. Uh, Jay, what, did you have any questions? Uh, yes, yes. Herman, would you check and see to what station, uh, what station General Sarnoff is listening to, would you please? Uh, yes, Jay. He's, uh, uh, his radio has WNBC on it, actually. 
not show it, Jay. He has a television set in his car, and he has Hugh Downs in his car doing a live Today show. Right. Yes, that's what he has, Jay. It's Hugh Downs sitting in the front seat uh, doing interviews uh, with the drivers. Murph Griffin just came down, Jay. He's walking over to talk to the general. Uh, Don McCannon uh, just grabbed Griffin. He grabbed him and is holding him back. Murph Griffin is waving. They put him in a car and said, that's, that's it, Jay. Murph Griffin's gone. They, uh, he was put in a group W. They took him away. He was put in a group W car as he was about to try to shake hands with the general. And uh, he was driven off. Uh, Jay, I believe, I believe they're getting the door open. Uh, they're getting the door open, and in just a moment, he should be up your way. Back to you, Jay Lawrence. Well, thank you very much, Herman Schlemiel. Uh, General Sarnoff, uh, they, they are getting the door open. I believe they will be allowed. Uh, they had to break the glass, and uh, that charge will go. It's still seven minutes until five. The charge for that glass will go to KYW Westinghouse. Uh, to one of the divisions of the Westinghouse Corporation in all probability. And uh, in a moment, uh, General Sarnoff will be up here, ladies and gentlemen. We'll just have to stand by for that, for that moment. It'll be in just any second now. It could be happening. Well, there's Mr. Tambourine Man, and that uh, from the KYW Sound 11 survey, soon to be the WKYC Sound 11 survey. It's four minutes until five o'clock. Let's go back out to Herman Schlemiel in the street and see if the general is in the building yet. Uh, thank you very much, Jay. The general is in the building now. The general has entered the building, Jay. Uh, he is on his way, so I can't see any more down here. Uh, a large crowd is following him into the building. He should be almost to your door. Back to you, Jay Lawrence. Thank you very much, Herman Schlemiel. I see him coming through the door now. Here's General Sadoff. Open the door. The band and the hail to the chief. He's walking very slowly into the room. Uh, let me read here what I'm supposed to Extend right hand. Bow slowly. Stand straight again. Okay. He's Looking over this way, looking at the orchestra now. All hail, welcome. Hail Caesar. And ladies and gentlemen, General Sarnoff is here in the studio, ready to, uh, he'll have something to say in just a moment. Uh, is the orchestra, do they want to play again? Uh, we will let them play the song again. They're walking up. Uh, sir, uh, there, we were wondering if there was anything you would like to say. I know that all of Cleveland is awake this morning and waiting uh, for the moment when you will have some pronouncement for us, something to say about the plans uh, of the station, sir. If you, if, if Mr. Parr, could you please... Jack, the band is playing. Jack. I don't think you can get the Tonight Show back, Jack. That's very good. Uh, the general is stepping over this way now, wearing a long... Uh, that's... No, I, I won't hold the peacock for you, sir. Must I hold this peacock in my hands this way? I... Hi, peacock. You have a name, peacock? Oh. Your feathers and General Sonoff, could you step over here, please? Sir? My name is Jay Lawrence, and I am one of the employees uh, of the station here right now. And, sir, is there anything? Could we have it quiet in here, please? Could we have it quiet? General Sonoff, is there any statement you would like to make, a statement of policy? that you would like to make the ladies and gentlemen the voice of General Sarnoff speaking to Cleveland for the first time. General, thank you very much. There's words to live by. There go the KYW officials as they gently leave. General Sarnoff is sitting down on his throne and so long, Don. Bye, Perry. Bye, Frank. Bye, Bill. Bye, Larry. There they go. They're all leaving. Oh, they're leaving us for old Lang Syne. Goodbye, KYW Cleveland, a Group W station, Westinghouse Broadcasting. 
These past nine years have really been something. There they go, the KYW officials slowly leaving. Now put that typewriter down. Put that typewriter back. You can't have the typewriter. No. That's that's it. Chet, grab the typewriter out of his hands. Chet just got the typewriter back, everyone. That's our <laughs> typewriter now. Thank you, Chet, very much. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is KYW Cleveland, a Group W station, Westinghouse Broadcasting in Cleveland. That's the last time you'll hear that. It's 5 o'clock, and happy days. <laughs> And here are the NBC people striding into the station with WKYC smiles. Hi there. Mr. Reed, good morning. Five o'clock. Morning, Mr. Margolis. Morning, Mr. Martin, Mr. Watson. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yes, sir. Uh, your shirts are ready, Mr. Martin. I have a medium spart starch done in them, just as you told me, sir. Uh-huh. This is WKYC in Cleveland. Wow, it's number one. Time for news. Macclesfield, England, three persons injured this morning when an explosion damaged two cottages. That's the breaking story at 5 o'clock. This is Bill Tompkins, and this is WKYC News. Paris, a French news agency. That's WKYC News, in part recorded. This is Bill Tompkins, standing by for WKYC Radio News and the Jay Lawrence Show. You're traveling first class with WKYC. Six minutes after five o'clock in the morning, the Jay Bird Show from WKYC, the big one for fun. On the way to the KWKYC Sound 11 survey, I'm going to be the first one to goof this morning, you know. Good morning. This is KYW Philadelphia, owned and operated by the Westinghouse Broadcasting Company, operating on an assigned frequency of 1060 kilocycles with studios located at 1619 Walnut Street and transmitter location at 5090 Joshua Road, White Marsh, Pennsylvania. This is KYW bidding you good morning. KYW Philadelphia, Group W Radio, Westinghouse Broadcasting. You have just heard KYW News on the Hour. The French news agency says that Algerian... On the way to the KWKYC Sound 11 survey, I'm going to be the first one to goof this morning. You know, I, you, you can't fail. I got the goof. Uh, somebody called already to welcome the new baby, you know. And so right away, uh, my first thing, you know what I pick up the phone and said, you know. And they said, what? I'm sorry, I must have the wrong number. <laughs> in Cleveland. It's eight minutes after five o'clock. I called Harry Martin, you know, as I do every morning at five o'clock in the morning to wake him up, and he still had the same type of greeting for me. I don't know. You'd think he'd clean up a little bit, you know, with a new image and everything. Summer's gonna be fun on WKYC this coming Friday, everybody. We